You are welcome to PSLE Maths. Let's look at a question from Red Swastika School, Prelims Paper 2020. This is question number 14. In the figure below, O is the center of the circle. OAC, OAB and OBC are triangles. OB is equal to OA. Given the angle OAC is equal to 17 degrees, first part of the question is name an equilateral triangle in the given figure. We notice that OA is equal to OB, which are the radius of the circle, and AB is given to be equal to AO, which means ABO is an equilateral triangle. So let's mark each of those angles as 60 degrees, and the answer to first part of the question is triangle ABO. Second part of the question is to find angle OBC. Let's look at the triangle OAC. OA is equal to OC because both are the radius of the circle. That means the triangle OAC is an isosceles triangle. So the sides OA and OC are equal, which means the angles opposite to the sides OA and OC will be equal as well. Given that OAC is 17 degrees, OCA will also be equal to 17 degrees. So now we can find the angle at O. The sum of the angles inside the triangle is 180. So 180 minus 17 degrees minus 17 degrees is 146 degrees. So let's mark that. Now consider the angle OAC which is 146 degrees and part of the angle OAB we know it to be equal to 60 degrees because it's part of the equilateral triangle. So the other angle is 146 degrees minus 60 degrees is 86 degrees. So let's mark that as well. Now consider the triangle OBC. This triangle is also an isosceles triangle because OB and OC are also equal. They are the radius of the same circle. This isosceles triangle, we know that the angle at O is 86 degrees. So the sum of the remaining two angles has to be equal to 180 minus 86, which is 94 degrees. The angle at B and C are equal to each other and they are together 94 degrees. So each of them are 94 degrees divided by 2 is equal to 47 degrees. So let's mark them as well. So that gives the angle OBC, which is part B of the question. The answer is 47 degrees. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe to this channel for more problem sums. If you have a specific question that you would like to see a video on, please post it in the comment section. Thank you.